What's up guys, welcome to another video. Today I'm gonna show you how to unlock your Samsung Galaxy phone. This method will work for any Samsung Galaxy out there. Now, uh, this is a very simple process. We will do a network factory unlock. It's very simple. We're not gonna do any kind of hacking or any kind of illegal shady stuff. And this is gonna be a 100% legit way to unlock your smartphone. Um, I've done this 100 times, so it is very, very safe. You will be able to use your phone with any carrier anywhere in the world. T-Mobile, AT&T, Vodafone, all those carriers are going to be compatible with your, with, with your Samsung Galaxy. Um, anyways, with that said, let's begin. So the first thing we have to do is to get your phone's IMEI number. To do that, simply open the dial pad and dial star hash zero six hash and you will see that the IMEI number will show up in the screen of your smartphone. Um, we will use only the first 15 digits, ignore the last two, okay? Uh, if you cannot find the IMEI number uh, with this method, you can find it in the back of your phone. Sometimes uh, a lot of the phones have them back there. Anyways, keep this number in hand because we're going to use it in a few seconds. So we're going to switch to the computer. Alright, so the next step is to go to the internet. Here we will unlock the phone. We have to fill in the form, the brand of your phone. So this will work for any other brand as well. Then you're going to write down your IMEI number. That's the number we got at the beginning of the video, so just make sure you write it down correctly. Then you have to type the email where you want to receive your code or the notification that your phone has been unlocked. So just make sure you write it down correctly. It's very important, otherwise you won't get your unlock code. So just make sure it is 100% correct. All right, so now you have to wait until you get your unlock code. This will take a couple of days, as I said before, so you have to be very patient. But for this example, I'm gonna show you how the email I got uh, looks. So I'm gonna go to my personal email account and as you can see here, I got this message and it confirms that the phone has been unlocked. So I'm just going to open it. So as you can see here, it says that everything went successful. And now we have instructions on how to activate the unlock. In some cases, you're going to have an unlock code. In other cases, you simply will get a confirmation that your phone has been remotely unlocked. Either way, I'm going to show you how to do the unlock or how to activate the unlock. I'm going to switch back cameras. All right guys, so after receiving the email with the unlock code, uh, there are two ways that you can unlock this phone uh, and, and that depends on your carrier. For example, for T-Mobile and AT&T, sometimes you will have an application, it's called Device Unlock App, and you should have it right here. So if that's your case, just open it and activate the unlock. In this case, for my provider, I don't have that um, application, so I'm gonna use a classic uh, way to enter the unlock code manually. So to do that, simply we have to power off the phone completely so just go ahead, click power off. We're gonna wait a couple of seconds until the phone is fully off. Now we have to insert a SIM card. So I'm gonna open the SIM card tray and I'm gonna insert a SIM card from a different provider. And now we're gonna put it back inside the phone and we're gonna wait a couple of seconds until the phone is fully on and it detects that we have inserted a non-supported SIM card. All right, it's gonna take a few seconds and once the phone detects a different SIM card, it will require an unlock code, which we only have to enter one time. All right, so as you can see here, it is requesting a SIM network unlock pin, and we have one out of 10 attempts to insert the correct unlock code. So that's where we need to insert the code. So let's go ahead and do it. All right, so this code will only work for one specific phone and it's calculated based on your IMEI number. So this exact code will not work for you. Anyways, we're gonna hit unlock. Boom, SIM network unlock successful. Perfect, that means that the code was accepted and the phone is now fully factory unlocked. But it is as simple as that, guys. That's how you unlock a Samsung Galaxy, any version. And um, yeah, if you have any questions, just leave them on the comment section down below and I'll try to answer all of them. Thank you so much and I'll see you on the next one.